In this lecture, we're going to do a quick connect and disconnect from the scan result. So what I'm going to do is inside of the project here, I'm going to actually call the Bluetooth manager and say on a connection, actually it's per device. So what I'm going to do here is device, scan result. And I'm going to actually do device dot on overall status change dot subscribe. Sync. Okay, wait. And then I'm going to do await task at delay time span from seconds 10. I'm going to actually close that there. Device cancel connection after 10 seconds. So, what this did was it automatically inserted the asynchronous operation. We're going to put to the debug log that we select an item. When the status changes, we're gonna actually put to the debug log when we connect and disconnect. We're gonna connect for 10 seconds, and after 10 seconds, we'll cancel the connection. So what I do is unlock the phone and run in debug. You'll see there's some errors here, so we should debug them. Abort. Can't await a void. So I'm going to delete that out, save the file, and run the debug again. As you see here, I have one more underline that should have been already fixed. should just go away on the next build. As you see here, the screen is waiting for the heart rate monitor to be turned back on. I'm going to select the item. As you see here, the item was selected. The status is connecting. any connection attempts. Now my heart rate monitor works very weird so I'm going to actually restart the app. Show the app on screen. monitor and now it's connected and it should disconnect after a bit and there we go after 10 seconds it disconnected so in this lecture you have learned how to connect and disconnect from a list view to a heart rate monitor